There it is. Who the hell lives here anyway? I don't know, no idea. But this is definitely the address. I've been scoping the place out for the past few days. No one's home. Here we are. Whoa. This place is humongous. <laughs> Where do we even start? We we'll start by finding a way in. And then we can take the grand tour. <laughs> you think this place has an alarm? Let's try and find a way in that doesn't involve breaking the window. Hey, Nathan, look. It's an open window. Oh, yeah. Here, follow me. Okay, give me your hand. All right, there you go. Come on, Nathan. Whoa. Spooky. Oh, here. I brought a spare. So, are we looking for any particular room? Just keep an eye out for any books, journals, any kind of research papers, you know? here. Nope. It's not gonna be in this attic. The boxes are filled with old traveling and camping equipment. Down we go. So, how do we find them? What, Mom's notebooks? I mean, don't you remember? She always used that off-white leather binding. Yeah, I know, but... It's such a large place. Here we go. White leather. Sam, I think I found one. For real? No. It's not one of Mom's. You got the right idea, though. Let's keep looking. Hey, Sam. Call me crazy, but this looks like a Ming Dynasty vase. Nathan, who in their right mind would have a Ming Dynasty vase just sitting around like that? Yeah, it's probably a knockoff of some kind. Yeah, of course it is. Hey, these boxes remind you of anything? Every place we ever lived. Exactly. I remember Dad was always like, why bother unpacking? We're just gonna move again in a month. Yep. Always the asshole. <gasps> Budge! Here, let's do it together. You ready? It's some sort of sarcophagus. Yeah. Look around. 
This whole place is filled with sarcophaguses. Or sarcophagi. Hmm. Sam. This is real. What is this place? Well, let's go find out. <laughs> Huh, this one's Roman. Third, maybe fourth century. Hmm. And you recognize that one? seen something like it before. Reclining figures. It's Etruscan. Ah, uh, that's right. Yeah. Husband and wife. And buried together. It's kind of dark. In like an awesome sort of way. <laughs> yeah. This place is like a damn museum. <laughs> Think they've got a dinosaur wing? Wouldn't surprise me. I do believe this is an ancient Mesopotamian washer-dryer combo. Hey, Nathan, check me out. Now, who am I? Huh? Dr. Livingston! Come on! <laughs> <laughs> nice. give to get an invite like this. So where are we going? Huh? Well, if you could go anywhere in the world, where would you pick? Anywhere? Anywhere. Okay, well. Here we go. India. Yeah, we'll visit the Taj Mahal. Round and round she goes. Soviet Union. Let's go to Moscow. Yeah, it might be a tad difficult to get in. I always wanted to see the Red Square, though. Let's try again. England. Sure would be cool to see Windsor Castle. Right, Sam? Hey! Hey, don't look at me. It's not my fault you weren't born yet. It's not like I remember much of it anyways. And it wasn't that cool. Uh-huh. Hey, check it out. Utility totems. Hey, are you a little young to be looking at that stuff? Wow. This table is as big as the ones in the orphanage dining hall. I bet the food here was better. <laughs> Wouldn't take much. Damn. They must have thrown some great parties in here. Judging by the artifacts, they certainly had enough money for it. Yeah. Looks like it's been a long time since the last one, though. Locked. Mom's stuff might be in one of these rooms. We gotta find another way in. <sighs> hey, the air vent. Up there. Going it alone. Hey, they've got your favorite book here. Really? Which one? 
a general history of the robberies and murders of the most notorious pirates. Yeah, more like a generally made up history. Even the author's name is a fake. Well, yeah. That could get us into the room below it. Not us. You. What? I can't fit in there. Can you handle it? You kidding me? Can I handle it? All right. Let's see what you got then. You ready? Oh, oops. It's a Polaroid. Let me see. I think it still works. Come here. Now smile, all right? Don't lose it. Okay, I'm in. Can you get the door open? Coding. Lots of painkillers. It's locked from this side, too. And look around. Is there a key nearby? Anything? Didn't see any journals. All right, well, we still got the other locked door, so come on. Wow. Ah, journals galore. Well, let's see what we find. something <laughs> This is it
church is a paradise? For that. What is he holding? Hey, 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 you keep your gun on me. Give me my journal. <laughs> all right, all right. All right. I'm sorry, Nathan. So what now? Now, we wait uh, for the police. Yeah, you don't want to have to deal with that headache. Stop. I mean, the hassle of ruining two kids' lives, that's... I really don't want to shoot you. Come on, lady. It was no harm, no foul, all right? We all must face the consequences for our actions. Hm. And at least let him go. I brought him down here so he could see our mom's stuff. That's it. He had nothing to do with this. What? I'm telling you that this is all on me. No. Your mother's stuff. Yeah, that, that journal it was our mom's. You're Cassandra Morgan's boys. Uh. <gasps> hi? My God. I could have shot you. Yeah, you still might, so, uh, do you mind? You knew her mom? She worked for me. As I'm sure you've noticed, I'm a collector of sorts. <laughs> That's sort of an understatement. So, Mom was like your translator? Your mother was the most brilliant historian I have ever met. We could have accomplished so much together. But then her illness and... I'm sorry. Happened a long time ago. Of all her discoveries, this would have been her crowning achievement. Sic Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Sir Francis Drake's motto. Yeah, Latin and historical figures. <laughs> Those were our dinner conversations. We were uh, a weird family. Did she ever tell you her theories regarding Sir Francis Drake and his heirs? Uh, Sir Francis Drake didn't have any heirs. Yeah. That's what history tells us. But your mother. 